Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. And good morning. This is Hollow Paddle. And it's early in the morning. And I have a sack to do. Um, so I get to open this. Dick's assignment is about Alcestis. Um, a play by Euripides, and it's saying that does the play reflect more of the original myth or more about modern day of the time that Euripides wrote it. My favourite. So Apollo says if you can get someone to die in your place it's all good. Only his wife's willing to give her life. The gate crashes the whole mourning process. To say sorry um, about losing Especially the role of women in society. Women were seen as wild creatures who were possessions, but also had responsibilities. They had to be good weavers, silent companions, good mothers, also had to be beautiful and virtuous. But also other Greek expectations, such as hospitality, was challenged. The reputed Wikipedia has an interesting point to make in regards to hospitality. to him. Along with the rich, um, rich layers of satire, mostly regarding the ridiculous nature of Admetus's grief, regarding the fact he kind of sent her to her death, also the myth begins differently in Euripides telling, with Alcestis already being an established member of the family with children rather than on her honeymoon, like in the original telling. So there are a lot of differences, so overall it can be seen clearly that there's a difference between the original myth and Euripides telling, and these differences were created to show a difference between the original myth, um, th these differences show a difference between Euripides telling and the original myth. Most of these changes are modernizations, and they really do reflect the home life of the modern time um, for these Greeks. So it really does show that Euripides had a thought for modern life when he kind of went along and wrote this play. It was the fourth um, play in a series of three plays, and the fourth play always is a satire play. He actually came second, I believe, in the competition where he presented all of his plays, which isn't bad considering he was considered so controversial that he rarely placed. He was kind of like um, the Chris Lilly if anyone's watched Summer Heights High, or Angry Boys, or We Can Be Heroes. He, he's that kind of figure, like, you know, everyone kind of looks and says, you know what, what he's saying is kind of right, but I don't like it. <laughs> so, it was kind of ignored. Um, so, all that stuff, yeah. Hey, no, awesome. it's not that early, it's after 11. If it wasn't for the fact you're the reason I have the box, I'd be really, really angry right now. <laughs> 